Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to record your Android screen for free using the ADV recorder. Maybe some of the reasons you might wanna go ahead and record your screen is so that you can share what's going on your screen with your friends or so that you can record your screen for your YouTube videos. Anything along those lines, I'm gonna be showing you how to do it in this video today. So make sure you stick around to the end so you do not miss out. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and download the screen recording software that we're gonna be using. And to do that, what you wanna do is go to the Google Play Store and look up the ADV screen recorder. It should just be the first one that pops up. And then you're just gonna go ahead and press install and accept. And now we just wait for it to install. Now that it's finally done installing, you just wanna go ahead and press open. And then you just wanna go ahead and press accept to the privacy policy. Okay, so the next step we're gonna take is we're just gonna change some of the settings up to best fit our screen resolution. And there's just some other features that I would like to show you guys. So what you wanna do is go in the upper right hand corner and press the three dots and go to settings. And you have an option to enable a three second countdown timer. I enabled that because it's best. Now I'm gonna go down to screen resolution and then just press use screen resolution and that will automatically fit it for the best screen resolution. Next, you can go down and change the bit rate and the video frame rate. I'm just gonna leave those as they are because they don't really need to be changed. I just found that they work best with their default settings. And this is optional, but you can have it record your voice while you're playing your Roblox game. And to do that, you just want to make sure microphone is selected in the record audio settings. Also, this is just optional if you want it, but you can have it use your camera and we'll use the selfie side of your camera to record your face while you're playing a Roblox game. And it's very useful if you want to share your screen and have your face recording at the exact same time. And that will automatically be enabled when you start recording your screen. So then the next step we're going to take is we're going to start recording our screen. And to do that, what you wanna do is press this plus right here, and then just press start now. And now you can just exit out of the app. And as you can see, the webcam is automatically enabled like we had it in the settings, but you can disable it by just pressing the webcam button in the control center on the side. And to enable it, you just press it again and it will re-enable it. And you can move the position of your webcam anywhere on your screen. So next step, we're actually gonna start recording our screen. So you just wanna press the control center and then press the circle on top and we'll have the three second countdown timer if you enabled it in your settings. And then we'll just go ahead and start recording your screen. And if you wanna stop recording, you just wanna press the control center again and then press the same button that you used to start the recording with. And after you save the recording, what you wanna do is there will be a notification that will pop up where you can access your recording and then you just wanna press which one you wanna view it in. You can view it in the video player or in Google Photos. I viewed it in Google Photos, but you can review it in whatever you want. And from here, you can do whatever you want with it. You can share it with your friends. You can go ahead and upload it to YouTube. Literally anything you want, it's up to you. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you haven't, like and subscribe so you don't miss out on more content just like this. And also, if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below because I reply to every comment that comes in.